Okay, Shams, you had a busy weekend, a lot going on off the court. We want to start with Damian Lillard seeing, seeing some news there. What's the latest on Portland and what they plan on doing? So I'm told Damian Lillard uh, essentially has been shut down for the remainder of the season. They had nine games left in the year over the weekend as they've decided to, to put him on the shelf. He's been dealing with a calf injury, but I think more so this is a team that's now four and a half games out of the play in berth with eight games to go. They're essentially eliminated. Since February 4th, they've lost seven games when they've been up by 10 points or more. They're 6-16 six and 16 since February 4th. And they also have a lottery-protected first-round pick in this upcoming draft. So there is an incentive for them to get to the lottery, keep their first-round pick this year, potentially even get into the top five, top three, depending on what type of luck you have, and see, either you draft at that position or you end up trading that pick. But I think when you look at this for Damian Lillard, that you have to wonder if he's going to play another game for the Portland Trailblazers just based on how, how much optimism there was going into this year after they got Jeremy Grant, the start that they had, and now not making it to the playoffs. Second year in a row for Dame Lillard. He's 32 years, he, he's 32 years old right now, 33 in July. So where is his future going to be? I expect there to be some real conversations this offseason about how this team can improve, and if they can't, where do they go with Damian Lillard and his future? Uh, there are definitely a lot of questions right now. Um, Chandler's played a lot against Dame Lillard. I'm curious what he thinks of, of Dame's future in Portland. Yeah, well, well, this year I get it, right? They're Like you said, they're out. They're not making the play in. If he's banged up, if he's got a lingering issue, all the loyalty that he's shown to this organization, shut him down. And, and, and the, there's nothing for him to play for, especially, like I said, if he does have nagging injuries, why risk that going into the offseason? But... The real question comes this summer. Do they look at moving him? Do they talk to him and have an open dialogue of what he wants, which I'm assuming that they will, right? Everything he's done, how vocal he's been about being there and being loyal and not ring chasing, that, that's who he is. I, I believe him when he says that. But he is getting older in age, and he's got to maximize these last couple of years of his career while he's still playing at an elite level. So. It'll be interesting. I, I honestly could see it both ways. I could see them getting a good pick and kind of, you know, building this team one more year around him and giving it one more shot. Or I could see them maybe moving him and, and do put him in a better situation, which he deserves. And, and everyone wants to see Damian Lillard on a great team that's contending. So it's tough. I get the decision right now. Season's over. Why, 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 why even play him? But uh, it's tough because I had the high expectations for this team with the, you know with with Jeremy Grant with the, the core that they had I thought they were a, a lock for a playoff team if you talked to me in October. Yeah, Chandler mentioned the point I wanted to mention. This absolutely disappointing season for the Portland Trailblazers, and yes, they had their injury issues, but so does every other team, and they're not even close to a playoff spot at this point. They're barely close to the play-in, and have essentially punted on the very idea that. It, it's got to be frustrating for Damian Lillard. He, you would, if I was him, I wouldn't want my Portland Trailblazers tenure to end like this. But 10 games under 500, nothing left to play for. And I'll say this. I'm going to be the skeptic. I'm going to be that guy. Dame is third in the league in scoring right now, 32 points a game. Great season. He played the exact amount of games you have to play to qualify for to be in the scoring leaders, 58 games. <laughs> and then called it, it, called it kaput on the season. So... Uh, you know, just a little interesting, just a little interesting, <laughs> a little tidbit, but very frustrating uh, season for that team. And and looking forward to the off season. It does you do have to wonder what happens with Dame because to be honest, he's their best asset if they want to build for the future. And he said time and time again, he's not leaving. He won't leave. He's, he's just, but he's toyed with it as well. So I don't know. It'd be interesting to see if his name comes up this summer. And if it does, there will be a lot of suitors. Third in the league in scoring. Uh, it's just, I can't even imagine. I mean, I want to, because for his sake, I'd love to see him play on a contending team. But I don't know any Trailblazers fans, and I would love to ask them if you're going to be cool if this happens. I have to believe they would be, but I don't 